Here we are, guys, in the House of Darkness, which actually has turned out to be kind of cool. All mazy and... And dark. And, and the a house. Well, not really a house. More a labyrinth of darkness. Who Billy. named this thing? Billy! <laughs> Billy, why? Yeah. Why do you hate me so? <laughs> anyway, even the enemies are tough. So where's the Business Suite Gamers? I'm the Opinionator. And I'm We Squares. And we are getting through this palace in this episode. End of story. It's somewhere. Huh. No! Die. No! It didn't ambush. It, oh, it's one of these. Final Assessor. Actually, the reason that I had Morgana here was I was assuming this was going to be a Scotty, so the idea was to Miracle Punch the Scotty. Yeah, yeah. Fortunately, upbeat. Well, we can't, unless we brainwash it, we can't make it join us. Can we? Oh, no, yeah, we can. It doesn't matter anymore. It's upbeat, though, so I just say a couple of random things. Okay, I have no idea what this thing is talking about. Uh, that it doesn't matter. It's just so easy to do this now. Norn. Oh, the fate. <laughs> All three of the fates together becomes Norn. Uh, okay, that makes How sense. How interesting. Well, good thing you didn't use wind on her. Doesn't have a weakness. Works for me. Basically, the uh, Norse version of Lachesis and yeah. those three. The Greek fate. I thought that I had associated that. Ah. I, it's, it's easy to mix up a lot of mythology, especially when I don't really spend a lot of time with it anymore. Yeah, yeah. Okay, well, we found like two treasure chests in here, and none of them even had anything good. Focus. But I think we're near the end. Surely. I can see it. I mean, if, if the map's any indicator. Damon, you know you want to go through the door. No, Damon, why are you going back? Back into the depths. Because I want to see where it goes. This is why we're still in this place. <laughs> you know, forget it. I... <laughs> I'm fine. I found a couple treasures. Got to both doors. It's good enough, right? <laughs> oh, we made it through. Is that it, though? It feels like there's more up ahead. Oh, God, no. Okay, finally. Just a boss or something. Incredible! I'm astounded that, that you could make it this far. Hey, that's a that's that awfully gregarious fellow who was at the reception desk. How to cheat outrageously? Huh? Wait, what the wall? That bastard! What's he trying to do here? Leave your complaining for later. Our path's been blocked, so we need to find a way around. At least, at least we can see it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, don't get me wrong, that actually was kind of cool. Mm -hmm. That was different and interesting, and it wasn't lame. Right. Oh. All right. Oh, I mean, there's a vent right there. <gasps> no! <laughs> I'm surprised it didn't give me t a, a confirmed chance. Yes! Yeah. Like, are you sure you want to enter this vent? Like, what, what else do you expect me to do? You can shoot for Hama own. Wish me luck! Good luck! Yes. Oh, it killed it! Great! Excellent! Good job, Akechi! Good it's like I always say, make sure you trust me in everything I say! Are you sure about that? <laughs> Isn't an enemy coming down the stairs? Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> you called it! Never again! Show me yeah, the enemy's just here. There's just no joke. Can't mess up at all. Right. You can't treat your elders like this. Fighting a lot of Obasans here. Yeah, this is definitely Obasan Wars. Really? Well, when that's the strike. I mean, that that's close enough. An automatic critical. We've just a never crit, yeah. We've just never had to deal with an enemy who is frozen. Yeah. Oh man, come on. Uh plus nuke hit some hard too, remember? Yeah. No sudden nuke. See, this this is just a good excuse to see Ryuji splash repeatedly. <laughs> v 
Fate is so fickle! Fate oh is God. so fickle! So you're saying you're fickle? As it turns out, I guess that is, that's it, isn't it? Fate is so fickle, I know! It's just not fair how fickle fate is! You know, I like how we were joking about how there aren't any locked chests here, but now we've run to three. Yep, in a I row. agree. <laughs> nice. Oh, yeah, Soma. Yeah, I wasn't actually paying attention to what we were getting. I was really just watching Makoto. <laughs> you can't be surprised by that. Not at all. Oh, hey, I I guess we got through. Yes. Ah, we were able to circumvent the wall of cards. It seems. Man, that long way around shit is bull. Where'd that bastard earlier run off to? Also, I you clicked away before I could finish reading my line. I was wondering how it was you completely failed to use prepositions while speaking. I got your prepositions right here. Mm -hmm. Hey, isn't this the thing that Shadow was messing with? If you see a button that has a red lock on it, you press it, right? Yes. Oh, we have an escape route now. We can proceed onward without having to worry about it anymore. Hooray! I wouldn't want to have to back... Oh, I guess we would still have to backtrack through the House of Darkness until we find a safe room anyway. Yeah, I know. I really want to get through this. I okay, so this is kind of neat. Th this sort of separates the place off into sections, kind of mm -hmm. like with Kaneshido, but we can do it in whatever order we like. And hello, safe room right before the mini-boss. <laughs> I assume that all the places are going to be unique, and unlike unlike with the gambling, we actually get to do something? Yeah, yeah. Alright, you! Inconceivable! How have you managed to make it this far? You truly are pests! Every time you think you've crushed them, they just come crawling back in! Do you try to kill everybody on the high limit floor? With this giant wine bottle, yes! What was that, you bastard? I hope you're ready. We didn't appreciate that stupid trap of yours. He's right. You didn't have any intention of letting us get past that maze in the first place. I... I guess... Oh, I get it. I get it. Huh? If you get this far, then it's like the system must crush you. And really, mm. if you're getting this far as, as a competitor... I see. Then it's a no mercy deal. I see, I, I see. I guess that's the best I can come up with. Oh, oh you are indeed correct. I thank you. That, that is, is how things are supposed to be. You're not worthy of victory. Now, won't you just lie down and do this for me? This isn't an easy job, you know. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. You need me to just die so you can have an easier job? How about screw you? Oh, is that so? Then it seems I have no other choice. Time to turn into an enemy you've already beaten. Or not! Are, that's really intimidating looking! Are we facing Poseidon? Snake Don't King! Don't do anything reckless! He looks badass! I I freaking love that like Final Fantasy IV Dragoon helmet! Yeah! He's got like a kind of dragon-y tattoo on his chest. Go Miracle Punch! No, 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 no. <laughs> Switch to the person who repels physical and... Lower his defense. Oh, that hurt a lot! Ouch! That really hurt a lot! <laughs> Gonna be Tarunda-ing that! Oh, it's got a lot of hit points! This could be problematic. This is pretty bad. <laughs> Maybe this will help? Well, I would think so. Well, doing it like this isn't exactly dramatic. Uh -huh. But it's going to work. Yeah. Thank you. I'm grateful. This thing 
it's pretty tough. But as long as we can keep up the same cycle of uh, healing, it should be okay. Yeah. Boom! Oh, excellent. I think that's the one thing you didn't buff for everyone. I mean, now that your defense is boosted, this thing is toast. Yeah, not so bad now. Prepare yourself. I mean, I'd like to re re up the attack boost, but right. And I believe I shall. <laughs> Darn it! Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's not bad at all, actually. If you can kill it before it gets a turn, that's not bad. Yeah. But can you kill it before it gets a turn? I guess so. You do have everyone... Everyone's got a buff. Attack buff. Yeah. Now you need to hit it as hard as you possibly can. Hmm. I suppose, actually, I am not going to be able... Right? ...to take that's, it out. That's what I was concerned about. Do you have anything that deflects lightning? Aha! And you can Tempest Slash it and hope it kills it. Taruda! I don't know if that works when they uh, concentrate. Oh, I guess it does. Well, the thing was, is his attack, like, concentrate is a, is a thing outside of, of oh. like, the, the level of their attack buff, you know? Oh, okay. So you, you I never know. even tried that before. I was just like, oh, God, they double buff, just defend. All right, die already. Jesus. Persona. Die already. God! I mean, he was a persistent one, but... I, well, I mean, he did the same thing every time, so it couldn't have been that bad. <laughs> and, you know, the entire team levels again. <laughs> Seems good. How many... T that's happened twice in this dungeon! <sighs> that must have been his plan from the very beginning. Why didn't he just rush us and try and beat us up if he was that strong? <laughs> Considering how things were on the members' floor, it's no surprise that this isn't a fair game either. Yeah, there they were just trying to cheat us, here they're trying to kill us. Yes. However, we're used to everything in a palace trying to kill us. That's sort of the norm. <laughs> Business as usual. Can't exactly be shocked by this. And yet we still reached our goal. Come now, let us go. We have no more business here. Hmm. We'll have to go to another game if we want to win more coins. Joker, should we just warp for some crap? Ugh, I hate it when they ask me these things! Like, keep the mechanics out of my dialogue, please! <laughs> ah! I see what the other area is. Maybe now we can look at the prizes, Damon. Do you think we can look at the prizes now? Or is the catchy just going to be all... No, you can't... Okay. Okay, good. So we don't know what they do. Hey, hey! I'm sorry, a despair ray gun? Yes. Oh, luck plus that 10. Is worth it. Futaba. How much does the feng shui charm boost it? Three. Oh. Yes, please. No. That's a null despair, not resist. Now, I'm thinking, I have seen several things recently that seem to be trying to protect me from despair. <laughs> Do you wonder if maybe we're going to have to deal with that soon? Maybe in the boss fight? It, I'm beginning to suspect that this might be the case, yes. Perhaps when that comes, I shall equip it on Makoto. <laughs> that makes sense. Not only does she get to hold out hope for uh, helping her sister, but she has energy shower. <laughs> yeah, that's true, that's true. Dang, that's good. That is a good ray gun. <laughs> I mean, it's better than my low brainwash. Very well, Battle Arena! Let us do um, battle or whatever. 
Now it should be some sort of like trading card game type thing. <laughs> That'd be great! Unless all I have to do is go find a Switch and flip it instead of playing the trading card game. Right, right. Like, I would have actually liked to have played the dice or something, you uh -huh. know? Welcome to the Battle Arena! The infernal fighting ground where the embers of life glow bright! Oh, it's you guys. <laughs> Our manager told us about you! Huh? The hell have you been hearing about us? My, my! You're so quick to anger! Wonderful! This would be quite boring if that wasn't the case. Now, allow me to confirm something before I begin explaining! Do you currently have 10,000 coins? Uh-oh! Or did you just go spend them on prizes? Uh, what? We don't. Yeah, prizes. Well, that won't do it all. Plebeians! This is out of the question if you don't have enough for the entry fee. You messed up and even saved the game after purchasing the prizes. That's okay, we can borrow from the cashier, remember? Game over. Oh yeah. We can borrow as much as we have, up to as much as we have. How fascinating, are there any repercussions? It doesn't say anything. Maybe when we're fighting, when we're fighting Sai at the end, if there's debt, then <laughs> something bad will happen. Hmm, it seems the games on this floor all require participation fees. Oh well, we need to play by the rules, so let's find somewhere we can win the necessary coins. We are not going through the House of Shadows anymore! So, after I complained about needing to play a game, I guess we get to go play a game. Well, it's possible we might find it in one of the lootable things around here. Point taken! Yeah, there was some there you could have looked into. I, I want to go play like the, like the, the slots or something. Darn okay. it! Okay. I mean, I, I have mixed feelings about this. On the one hand, darn, no. Ah, oh, well. Good! I get to play a game. Don't take my games from me, Billy. <laughs> I don't know if we can go back and replay any of them. Oh, yeah! Stimulating gameplay. This is what I wanted. Are you getting your fix? Look, it only needs to... I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I guess after the hacking, we're not going to lose anything. Maybe. But maybe we're not going to win anything either. <laughs> like, how many times do you think we need to do this? Oh, this time. Bye, bye. Because as it turns out... Nothing is happening. We're not making any progress. We put the payout in, we receive that amount out. I, one of the reasons that I am constantly blathering is I want to see if anything is going to be different. <laughs> I was asking to be able to play a game. This is the game they gave me. <laughs> I'm going to give it back to them. <laughs> Though I do appreciate how occasionally a card will fall down in front of the camera. Yeah, yeah. I do. No, I don't want to fight anything. Ah! Ah! What did you think was going to happen? They're just going to spawn more dudes. Everything is going poorly. Quick, hop up on something! Hey, wait, don't I have an item or something? Poof! Huh! I just can't do anything right! This is all just a terrible disaster! It's so tantalizingly close, we just need 170 coins! Really? You can't even play the big one? I suppose if you could play the big one, then you wouldn't need to go upstairs and play any of the others. I am not going to go into debt. You're just so paranoid about that because it could potentially be very true. Yeah. Kill me. Hooray! Hey! Progress! Oh my god. No, the opposite of progress. I mean, isn't aren't the, the winning odds supposed to be like 8 in 10? 
Uh, for the big one at least. I don't know about about these. Oh, random number generator. Why do we trust in you? Alright, now we're only 10 away! I think the dice might be better. We'd have like, at least a higher chance of success. Don't you have to guess the number it's gonna roll? I remember it was you had to guess the range. It's That's what it said, but you had to guess between like 3 and 10 or 11 and 18. That's what you actually had to choose, so it's really just a higher look. <laughs> Freydine looked pretty good. This is just insulting! So close! Okay. This one's gonna be between 11 and 18, except it's gonna be between 3 and 10. Gosh darn it! <laughs> All we've gotta do is just win! <laughs> what a hurdle we never could have predicted! If I just would have waited, then it would have been. There you go. We okay, got it we out. freaking got it. We can get the heck out of here now. See, ultimately less time. All right, I have your dang ten thousand. Okay. What? Okay, so it looks like there was gonna be a scene, but we didn't get to see it. How fascinating. Huh? Oh well. So, a series of one-on-one -on -one battles. Oh, okay. that's or That's awful. Uh, oh. Well, I think we know. Okay. <laughs> we just have to win one battle? How about this? Yeah. It's probably not going to be one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah, because he, he can use any persona. <laughs> well, let's go. Only you will be able to continue from here onward. We'll be cheering from the stands, so best of luck! Hmm... I wonder if I should equip some other accessory. Probably. Well, when in doubt... Yeah. I, I think the Roland medal is the way to go. Yeah, I agree with you. If it turns out that I just need need protection against some specific status, then so be it. Yeah. How many uh, how many chances to prepare have, have they given? Like quite a few. Quite a few. Several in a row. <sighs> kind of cool. Okay, I'm just making sure. Ah, you still technically have Futaba. Excellent. <laughs> I suppose since she's technically hacking, they can't stop her. Now then, our grubbing metal is finally here! The idiot leader of the adult defined thieves has come! Odds are 1.1 1 .1 to the house, 23.0 to the Phantom Thieves. Wow! The Phantom Thieves are surprisingly popular! It's rare to see odds in the double digits! Now, let us begin our serious one-on-one -on -one battle! Bring out the first contestant! Uh, what the hell? There's two of them! We call this a one-on-one-on-one -on -one -on -one battle! This isn't one-on-one -on -one at all! They're just ignoring the rules right from the beginning! Shocker at this point! Now then it's time for this hellish trio of battles to begin! Trio? I thought it was only one battle! Oh dang, it's not even a regular one. Well, they were weak to Psy, if I recall. Yeah. Poof! Oh, thank god. Hmm... The thing is, though, is... I can't all-out attack. Correct. So and you should probably toast one of them. Oh, come on! Wait, what? He just ignored it. Okay, I'm thinking that, honestly, I just want to do this. Yeah, that makes sense. Do they have any non-physical attacks? 
Well, it doesn't matter. Gira Mekala also has, like, such an obscenely high amount of endurance. That's true. Blast it. Huh. Okay, so they're wasting a lot of turns. Yeah. This one. I guess I'd be scared or something. Persona. But he's gonna hit me with a physical attack. He's gonna bounce back, yeah. Oh, and you're just despair! Never mind! Well, this is only the first of three battles, although they're probably lying and there's gonna be a fourth one. I think I'm gonna pop a snuff soul. Considering all the other SP recovery items that exist, uh -huh. like, surely it should be okay. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe I should have switched to bugs. No! I think having repel physical is... Right. Wow! wow. He really can't take a hit! The stupid Phantom Thief has won! Boom! Boom! Says the unbiased announcer! You suck! You know, that's a little hard to say. I'm just gonna call the Phantom Thief from now on! <laughs> <laughs> oh, if you bang on the house, do not fret. The second round of contestants is arriving now. Huh. They're even more than before. How cowardly. There's nothing fair or honest about this. Right down to the peanut gallery. Now, it's time to die in this blood-curdling battle. You know what I'm thinking? Gear McKella, because he's resistant, he's immune to both of the things they do. I have a better idea. Do you? Why, yes, I do. It also has Repel Fizz. Oh. But they're not weak to ice, are they? No, but who cares if they're weak to it or not? They can't hurt me, so I win. That's not Repel. Oh, because they block Fizz, too. Yeah. Okay. Go down. Okay, they're dead. Give me a break. Oh, don't say that, because next is going to be one of those snake guys. By myself? Bullshit! When the hell are you dying, you goddamn phantom dweeb? I have a bet on this, too! Now there's no way in hell you're getting away with this! Time for our final contestant unless there's one afterwards! Thor? What in the... Yowza, that's a big one. Oh, this isn't bad. That's Thor! Go grind his bones to dust! And to make your bread? <laughs> I mean, what is the Jack and the Beanstalk stuff? Oh, it is the giant. Let the extreme third battle begin! Lightning and physical. Watch out for lightning and physical if he's anything like the fourth one. I... It's Thor, I cannot imagine how it would be something other than that. Let's just take a quick look here. <laughs> I mean, this is probably your best bet. Right, Gary McCalla. Why should it be anything else? <laughs> I'm just concerned he's going to use, like, Ragnarok on you and hit you for obscene lightning damage. It'd be funny if you... He's about to magic you! He used charge. He's about to physical you! Don't listen to me. <laughs> I'm right, right? He used charge? Yeah, he used charge. That means it's gotta be physical, right? Yeah, maybe you should guard just in case. It might be almighty. Man, I, well, I don't think you're correct. Okay, it's Megatux. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> it's all fine. No, you're right about cautiousness, though. Once again, justice prevails. The payout, payout will be, be handed, handed over, over after this. Please wait. Oh, I kind of expected the announcer to jump in and be the fourth opponent. That kind of would have been awesome. But we got the 100,000, so... For real? Oh, shit! That was freaking amazing, Joker. Yeah, use Gira Mekala. <laughs> Doesn't this mean we're done with the dungeon? I guess? I mean, assuming that we secure the treasure in the next room. There might be a little bit more. You were incredible. 
They never even planned on giving you a fair fight in there, but you're also not really fair yourself. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was going to say. Yes, I expected that would be the case. Our other trials have been rigged as well, after all. So you sent Joker in knowing full well the possible dangers? I simply had faith in his skill, and to be honest, there was no other course of action available. I did fine, guys. I did more damage to myself with physical moves, <laughs> so it's all good. Come now, we should head to the bridge. This shall be our moment to shine. Bridge, where's the damn to bridge? To your left. Yeah, it's over there, okay. Up there. I I'm staring at the map and being like, Gah. did you say up there? Up there, yes. Don't ever do that again. Oh, day. Sorry, that was a stretch. <laughs> Okay, we'll just set the card on the scale. <laughs> Authenticating members card. The required number of coins to activate the Bridge of Judgment is 100,000 coins. <laughs> we got that. Now let us through. It seems you worked hard to gather that many coins. I never expected you would make it this far. I commend you on your vigorous efforts. However, you will never proceed to the manager's floor ahead. From this moment forward, the number of coins from the, for the bridge will increase to one million coins. Oh, God. What? That's not fair. You can't give us an impossible task like that. Ah, you finally understand? That is the point. Your task will forever be impossible. Hence, I will emerge victorious. We had only just barely gotten 100,000 coins as well. She said she would let us through if we had uh, 1 million coins. Yes. In that case, there won't be a problem. What? Y you know how to win that many? Not exactly. I already have the requisite coins right here. Huh. What? How could that be? Do you remember what we were told at the very beginning? Essentially, we could borrow as many coins from the casino as we already held on our card. Well, yes, but... Do you have a moment? For example, had we borrowed the max when we had 10,000 coins, we would have ended up with 20,000. And had we then bet on Joker at the Coliseum as a guest, our total would have grown to 460,000. Yes, but you're speaking purely in hypotheticals. That's not what actually happened. So he actually went he ahead- used the other membership card. Hmm. Correct. On Joker's card. However, that is not the only card in our possession. You have another card? That's- That's the Taro Tanaka card I told you to get rid of. Exactly. Instead of disposing of it, I secretly used it to gather coins and outsmart this system. Which he did. Surprise. Betting on Joker and... 460,000 coins? That means we would have over 500,000 if we add all of our coins together. <laughs> so what? That's still clearly not close to the required total. Actually, once my account reached 460,000, I borrowed the maximum amount a second time. That means... After paying back the original 10,000, I was left with 910,000. Adding Joker's total to that brings us to 1,010,000 coins. We can surely cross the bridge now. <laughs> Wait! If we borrowed all them coins... Is there a problem? The manager's room lies ahead. We won't need to worry about coins after this. But aren't we going to be attacked with some awful thing that's going to have something to do with our debt? Then we can blame Akechi for it. No, this is really interesting, though. This is kind of the level of involvement I was hoping to get in mm -hmm. palaces, except, unfortunately, not as much of it was what we were doing, yeah. but rather it was what Akechi was doing. Right. I, I think this place could have been could have been much better if it were more involved. Mm-hmm. But it's not like it was... Uninvolved? Yeah, hmm. I don't know, I guess... I guess so far my impression of it is just kind of middling. Mm -hmm. I don't know, what, what do you think? Yeah, I kind of feel like the first two areas were kind of like, uh, and then things kind of opened up a little on the third floor, but there wasn't really enough of it to... Yeah, if there would have been more stuff like what, what we got on the third mm -hmm. floor... Or like more of the third floor? Yeah. Because maze notwithstanding... We did kind of blow through it eventually, and then blew through the arena like no problem. Well, I mean, that's no problem, but it was still a fun scenario. Yeah, I just kind of wish there was more. 
Yeah, I agree completely with that. Or did you honestly intend on paying back such a large sum? Impossible! This can't be- the rules can't be used against me! I use the rules against others! I mean, can't she just increase the limit again? Crow, it's really weird to call you that. It's actually a little frightening how sharp you are. I'll take that as a compliment. I'm glad I was able to contribute to our Phantom Thieves efforts. Very well. Now, we should Let's hurry and let the bridge down before she decides to change the rules once again. Why, yes! There was indeed an awkward cut there because we were just checking to see how full the map was. And then the map fully opened up the House of Darkness and we saw we missed a treasure in there, which turned out to be a model gun. So oh, yes, we went and got that. Yeah, that was totally the right call that we went to get it. You have to use the console, David. What? I go over here? No. I look for a model gun. Is there a model gun behind this treasure chest? No, David, there's only cards. Okay, I'll, I'll hit the button, fine. <laughs> Card authorization complete. Your current total is one million ten thousand twenty coins. Sure is a good idea that we went and hit the switch before she could change the rules. Do you wish to activate the bridge of judgment? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, no, the rules are changed. No, they already hit the switch, but you figure it shouldn't matter. Right? I mean, it's her palace. Hell yeah, we're almost there. But then again, they clearly don't have complete control over their palace. Not That's true. Complete, That's true. Just mostly complete. Mm -hmm. We better be ready for whatever lies ahead. That are you means a, a mini boss is coming. You know that, right? Or we're just going to find the treasure. I mean, you know, whatever. I. Guess we were prepared to find the treasure. Here Might we still go. Be a boss. It looks like this is her base of operations. Perhaps her treasure will appear on that pedestal. Just like it'll appear everywhere else that glowy wobbly aurora thing is. A lot has happened, but we managed to get up here. Miss Manager's days are numbered. How on earth you to simply barge in here? Elegance is necessary for victory as well. I'm sorry, did you say something? <laughs> we can't hear you! I entertained you with all of my games, but it appears you are still far from satisfied. We were... What? Who wants to eat a pie? We were maybe a little entertained, yeah. Very well. I've made preparations especially for that possibility. Doesn't she seem kind of hapless, sort of, as the ruler? Again, she has like... Yes, yes, she has... No real presence as the ruler. Maybe because it's so new? Maybe that has something to do with it? That's that is very possible. I mean I think I think that you're you were most likely correct when you said it's because she has such a large presence in the game. Yeah. That her shadow isn't supposed to be to upstage her or yeah. make her ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. Because that definitely did happen with a lot of the other characters. They mm -hmm. were upstaged by their shadows. Well, we'll come pretty soon and beat you up. Sis. I mean, again, the important part is we are trying to save her. Conve yeah. Conveniently, it also saves all of us. <laughs> well, you know. Our infiltration route is secure. We need to head back out and send the calling card. After all, we already know she becomes our ally. We've known that from... Yes fairly early in the game. It's because she's a confidant. That was a pretty big hit. That is true. I kind of wasn't... Yes, okay. <laughs> and once the calling card is sent, sai -san's treasure will appear, correct? Yeah. Once the target is cognizant of the danger, that cloudy thing will take shape. wonder what it'll look like. I wonder. What will the treasure look like? <laughs> What's he, apparently? That depends on the person. Here, it sort of doesn't really matter. Not really. Only Kamoshida's was strongly manifested here. It looks like there's a card in there. Yeah. Or maybe a picture. Like some sort of rectangular sheet of something. Yeah. But none of the- For Kamoshida, it was a medal. Madarame's was a painting, and Kaneshiro's was fake money. Well, that's after 
if they'd gotten to the real world. So that is what they're talking about. Yeah. Because Kamoshida's was strongly manifested in, in his palace as a crown. Yeah, yeah. Father's was a plastic model. In other words, the treasure is what marked the beginning of the palace ruler's aspirations. Oh. It could also be what caused their desires to swell. Maybe a photo of her dad? Maybe. Thinking about it won't get us anywhere, though. Let's head back and prepare the calling card. Hmm? What's up? You curious about the treasure? Speaking of that, it actually looks like there's a shape formed in the haziness. If I had to guess, I'd say Sis's treasure is a police notebook. Ah, their dads. Right, your father was. She probably thinks Dad died because the police were using him. I mean, like we pointed out before, Makoto and Sai kind of have like a completely different idea about their dad. Mm -hmm. With Sai, there's apparently some level of resentment towards either the system or something. Yeah, yeah. That's why she believes justice is meaningless and that there's no point in living a subservient life. Hmm. Dad's death is even the reason she aspired to become a prosecutor and grew so obsessed with winning. Maybe this isn't a new thing, then. It's just not quite how she came across. Mm, maybe that's... I don't know. I think that was the... Mm, I think that was the birth of a palace. I mean... I think that makes sense, but based on what Makoto is saying here, it seems like that's something that's been brewing for some time. Right, but that doesn't necessarily mean it became distorted yet. You know, that's a good point. Otherwise, every every Joe Schmo with yeah. some ambition would just suddenly have, a, like, a palace and... Like, she would have definitely had desires. a distinct shadow in the metaverse for a while. Or in Memento, specifically. Yeah. She really loved him. Hmm. Sai-san's heart must be exhausted from living in such a fiercely competitive world. Honest beliefs alone are not enough to get you through. Even I understand that pain. But that is exactly why we need to change her heart. Yes, you're right. And now we've ascertained the location of the treasure for that goal. Would you like to return to the... Ah, <laughs> kill me! <laughs> no, let's look around in here. Might be something in this room, you know? Yeah. There's nothing in this room, I know, but... I just want to rebel against the system. The system of asking me if I want to fast travel from place to place. Are you prepared to fast? Would you like to press the button? Would you like to press the button? No. Do you need a moment before you press the button? Aha. I, you know, I feel like we probably have been too hard on this palace. Uh-huh. But nonetheless, there was something that did just irritate me about it. Yeah. Yes. It's like the pro the prospect that we might get to play, like, some mini games or something, and then it was just like, nah, you just cheat. Yeah. Maybe that. No, I mean, the problem isn't the cheating. It was that... The, the idea of the mini games are played up, you know? Yeah. And then they take them away, and then when we go and play it, it's like, eh. It's like we enjoy us the mini games, you know? I mean, I don't want to. I'm not trying to be too obsessive over playing the dang slot machines, but I don't know. I perhaps the thing that really did that, that really did irritate me at least mm -hmm. was the fact that I could never fully reconcile the idea of this place being a casino in the first place. I suppose so. Uh, you're back. We finally made it. All that remains is to actually send the calling card. Looks like we'll manage to get it out before that investigation starts going down, too. We still don't know anything about the true culprit behind the mental shutdowns, though. I wonder if we'll learn anything from Nijima-san's shadow. I sure hope so. That was sort of half of the point of doing this. I doubt she has ascertained any relevant clues. I agree. That is why she has the warrant out on the Phantom Thieves, after all. Furthermore, the public believes arresting us will solve the case. The public prosecutors won't stop now. They have the weight of the general public on their shoulders. If only we knew who the true culprit was, we wouldn't have to fight Nijima-san's shadow. Who could it be? Do you think it's someone we know? <laughs> 
Hey, Haru, I think there's something on your nose. It's the point. <laughs> <laughs> that definitely is possible. <laughs> Don't you think, Akechi-kun? True, but there would be no end to the mistrust if we began <laughs> doubting our peers. Isn't that right, Akechi? Either way, we only have one opportunity to turn the tables. Isn't that right, Akechi? <laughs> This final calling card shall be my magnum opus. Simply let us know when you're ready, Gino. But remember, you're trying to finish off the confidants, and you probably don't have that much time, so you'd better just send the stinking card. Right! I don't know why everyone keeps asking me for my input. <laughs> Well, we said we'd finish the palace in this episode, and we did. So now it's Ooh. time to fit in a confidant event. Hey, we can, right? And we are going to send the card immediately. Yes. So? I'm so exhausted. Thanks to my quota and that shithead chief. But I made some progress on my personal investigation. Oh, what'd you get? I did some research on the Phantom Thieves. That is your job. That is, in fact, specifically your assignment. It is what you are paid to do. Your position is to cover the Phantom Thieves. It's good that you did some research on them. I'm glad to hear it. <laughs> I'm starting to get the impression they might actually be the real deal. Isn't it a little late to be thinking this? No signs of an internal power struggle. No dirty money changing hands. Oh, that's what she means. It almost seems like all this recent negative press was fabricated. There's no actual proof to support the claims. And I mean, you're still a fan, right? No, oh, yeah. Honestly, the more I get to know about the Phantom Thieves, the better I understand them. I can relate to their sincerity. They remind me of how I used to be. I already know firsthand that fighting the evils of society is a never-ending, thankless job. You know, you never have to give up in doing that. But I still do it nonetheless. I bet the Phantom Thieves share that same type of passion. I mean, sure, I, I get that, like, kids tend to be real idealistic, but why do you have to throw that away? Cynicism? Uh, maybe her partner getting... No, I'm talking <laughs> about in general. Oh, okay, I'm not talking okay. about Oya specifically. <laughs> I never thought I'd hear you talking about passion, Ichiko-chan. Maybe all this talk about the Phantom Thieves has influenced you. Or maybe it's just a kid. Maybe. I mean, he is a pretty big fan of theirs, so... Yes, this is Oya. That's right. What? You found Kayo? Where is she? What do you mean you can't tell me? Why the hell not? Hey, what's going on? Wait! Kayo... What? I thought she died! That was one of my journalist friends. He thinks he found Kayo. He followed up on a pretty far-fetched string of rumors for me, but now he's saying he doesn't want to get involved. I guess she just disappeared, but there's no there was never any reason there's for no us. There's no evidence. Yeah, there is never any reason for us to think that she would still be alive after crossing the cabal. Right? Damn it! Why the hell won't he tell me what's going on? I can't just give up now. At least that's progress. I mean, we didn't even know Kaio-chan was still alive before now, so... Stop right there. Ugh. Huh? I knew it. You've been looking into Kaio's case behind my back. Well, not anymore. I've cut off all of your resources. I suggest you drop this investigation if you don't want to face the consequences. Wait, you're the one who pressured my contact to keep quiet? I told you, this is where your wild goose chase ends. Oh, and I'll be doubling your quota again. No more of this personal investigation, got it? What? Are you trying to kill me? Hey now, Mr. Chief, can you really do that? I don't think anyone asked for your opinion, bitch. Listen to me, Oya. Give it up! Unless you want to end up just like that stupid friend of yours! Don't talk about Kayo like that. Stop Don't you around. dare! If you even think about talking shit on Kayo again, I won't hesitate to beat the living crap out of you! I really appreciate that spirit that she's showing. Whoa, whoa hold on! <laughs> Take back everything you just said. Or, 
I'm going to do even worse. <laughs> it's too late now. The higher-ups have decided to put that incident to rest, and, and that's what we're doing. You understand? That spineless little bastard only cares about himself. Shit. This had to happen just as I got a new lead on Kaio. What should I do? Should I go knock him out? That would be really cathartic, but you probably shouldn't do it. Let's think of another way. Yeah. That's easy for you to say. It is. No, I need to stay calm. Calm. Yes, calm. Deep breaths. I can't give him any more reason to fire me. Just stay calm and give me like eight drinks. <laughs> ah, this sucks. And this is why she is in the bar <laughs> all the time. An even greater quota is going to be a problem, but I can't give up now. Man, is she really going to keep going? I... Like, the further on her confidant gets, the more interesting it is. Because it, it was kind of like, meh, for a while. <laughs> but, I, but I guess it's just that it's more involved. Uh-huh. And hopefully the rest of the investigation isn't going to happen at this bar. <laughs> I wouldn't hold your breath. Yeah, you're right. I promise I won't stop fighting. I'll prove it to you with another great article. Exclusive, The Phantom Thief, Stealing Hearts and Changing Lives. That's worth an extra drink, right, Lala-chan? Isn't this not the right time to be doing a story like that? Shh, confidant events. Main story. Ah, <sighs> sorry. I really will try and calm down now. I'm, I'm impressed, though, that she just jumped in his face and didn't back down at all. I mean, well, if she gets fired, it might be sort of hard for her to get another job considering her past. Oh, well, right? I mean... She can come work for Lala. I'm still frustrated, though. All that bullshit he said is really getting to me. I wish I was better at controlling my emotions, like you are. Well, you don't seem to let anything get to you, ever, like some kind of robot. Well, all you have to do is not say anything until you see something really awful, and then you get extremely passionate and angry about it, just sort of quietly. <laughs> kind of like you did. No, I actually was impressed, so I can't yeah. even ding her for it. Yeah. Been saying it the whole time. Huh? So. Nobody said anything like that sweet to me before. More importantly, Ichiko-chan, how are you going to manage having your quota quadrupled at this point? I'll just work twice as hard. I should be fine as long as I keep getting good info from my favorite source here. Give me some news. Oh, that reminds me. Let me hear all about today's scoop. Whoop to do. <laughs> now it increases charm. Okay, I see how it is. I sure hope the rest of that, the rest of her confidant, is pretty good. Yeah, me too. It would totally be like the surprise turnaround. Oh no. I mean, you know, a lot of a lot of games or stories have that, like a character you don't really care for at first, uh -huh, uh -huh. and then after a point, you're like, wow, they actually ended up being one of the better characters in the show. Yeah, yeah. Well, unless we madly decide to spend time with another confidant, which isn't impossible. Yeah, it just depends who's available. Next up's the calling card. And even if we do spend enough... Uh, yes, yeah, what he said. Sometimes it breaks, what can I say? 